Alright guys, so I kind of just want to do a little uh, comparison between Firefox and Chrome. Uh, you're probably thinking, what's this kid doing? He's recording gameplay, one video, and then the next he is talking about browsers. It's not really related to my channel. I just wanted to kind of do like a quick how-to for customization because I realized Chrome is way more customizable than Firefox. Firefox didn't really let you expand. It kind of it lets you change your theme, but let me get into Chrome here. You could change your theme, but the only thing it changed was your tab bar. It didn't it didn't do anything past that, which was kind of I didn't like that. I like everything being personalized to me and what I like. So as you can see, different theme as for when you open up Firefox in a new tab, it would just be a white screen with the Firefox in the middle and the Google bar. That was that was about it. There was no customization. Um, one of the major things was definitely Facebook customization. It they have it in Firefox, but they're kind of sketchy. I don't really like installing Firefox add-ons because a good chunk of them are not trusted. But if I go over to my Facebook here, which I'm on just kind of a random page I made for this video as to more or less reduce my work of having to make uh, block out bars to all the people on my Facebook and I have installed actually go back over here Facebook themes now once you install this you don't really need that if you go right here in your Facebook and click on this it'll open this up and basically there's tons of themes I mean these are just the ones I have installed I'm a fan of the green but I like the blue too and by the way it's just as simple as enabling and disabling and it switches I like I like the thought of this one, but it doesn't really flow. As you can see, it kind of middles off, then sections off to the borders. And then this one I also like, but it's kind of just, it's kind of cluttered. I don't like that. It doesn't make, it looks the same, except with a cluttered background. I'm not a fan of that. And this one actually is not for Facebook. It is, let me make sure all these are disabled. It's for the login, which is pretty nice. I like that. But the only problem is sometimes it does conflict. Like, if I enable the green one again to change the Facebook back to the neon green, the same thing happens to the Facebook login. But I'm not complaining about it. I still like it. And the next thing I want to move on to is actually Google search. I mean, you're probably thinking, what can you do with the Google search? Well, recently they've pretty much made it so you can't have background images personalized to your login, which, as I said earlier, customization is a huge thing with me, and I did not like that. So I changed my background, which I used a program called Stylize for. And just by going to it, a hundred pages of different add-ons and themes for Google. Which, you know, that's pretty cool. I mean, it even it even changes the search. It all, all of it looks different. And speaking of my YouTube channel, the next place I want to go to is YouTube. Using Stylish also lets you change YouTube. As you can see, when you hover over a video now, it's a red on black instead of the white and red kind of bland look. I didn't really like that. And if you go to your channel and click on a video, and in your settings, which I found this really cool, any buttons you press have a fade in glow, which is little things like that that I like. And moving on from there, I really think that's about it. Um, 
Facebook themes, like I said, is how you find this. Um, and then the next one is stylish themes. And stylish does not actually have themes for every website you may visit. But there are ones that allow you to create your own themes, which are also trusted apps. So if you want to play around with that, you know, why not? Um, I believe that's about as much customization I've did to my Chrome browser so far. But the same thing with YouTube. If you go over here, find more styles. Find something that's you, you know, find something that you like and, you know, that relates to you or that you like. It's, I mean, there's 62 pages of YouTube, but it's, oh my god, fucking Skype, get off my Skype, stop talking to me. And yeah, that's pretty much it, and as for my gameplay, I plan on uploading more. Holidays have been kind of busy. <coughs> I'm actually babysitting 10 boxer puppies right now, so they're keeping me pretty busy. But I do plan on uploading some more after the holidays come around. And if this tutorial helped you in any way, well, not so much a tutorial, but if it helped you, let me know in a comment. You don't have to like or subscribe to the video. It would be nice, but I don't, I'm not all about that. I just like helping, so if it helped, let me know. Alright, thank you. Bye.